Some more patterns I've noticed about these, uh, the Voynich manuscript that was found in the 15 or 1600s. Supposedly written about. What we have is a strange script of writing in a book size manuscript that a human could have written. It wasn't real big, wasn't real small, but it's got colored pictures of plants plus their their uh, roots. It also has, and this is what I've noticed, many naked young nubial women. And they are always in a, what looks to be like a pond, but they're only always up to their knees, just about. And they have a some kind of tube that leads to them. And this is more of the manuscript, and it it appears to be star systems, or uh, they weren't taking nature photos, whatever they were. And I don't believe any of this was written by human. Here we have. The different root systems and it looks like they were stored in these different shaped bins and I don't know if those are these plants are classic of of um, uh, earth or not and we here we have more women they're always women You see, they're always women. They're not. They're not. They're not men. And they're always up to their their knees or it, it, this whatever fluid or whatever it looks like is not covering their waist. So I I was just kind of wondering about that. I think that whoever wrote this was a botanist, studied plants. The pictures were done first, and then the script. And if you'll notice on a script, how many times have you ever seen ink script that was written after the picture, and there's no screw-ups in the script? There's no um, cancellation marks. There's no uh, erasures. Nothing. That, that just seemed odd to me. You get one chance to do it and that's it. Then he's got more plants. I'll just say he. And he references them by this container, this container, this container, this container. So whoever it was, they were into plants. More containers. And these are detailed notes of something. The numbers up here mean these are nothing. These are written by somebody who found the manuscript who's just trying to catalog the pages. And here we have the women again. Now I don't know if it was normal in the 1500s or whenever this was done. The women are all generic looking like uh, they're not they're, you can tell they're women they're sitting down in something green. The green is very, very green for being that old. And then there's some kind of blue that's coming down into them. And this looks like, I, I have no idea what this is. It could be, it could be damn near anything. And here's more plants that they were, they're working on. Now this is one of the things that I noticed. Uh, say that's an ordinary woman and that's an ordinary woman and they are they are standing in some kind of a seed pod or something and they have this lady has got her hands in this whatever it is and these are more these are done in black and white and I'm wondering if the handwriting 
is the same as the color handwriting or if another individual did this that would prove that there are more more than one person that or whatever wrote it there were more one of them that could write like that if they if there was more than one of them then they could understand them here's more pictures Now these are all, it looks like this is a vector here, it looks like a fish, we don't know what, I don't know what the hell it is, but the women on the first round are in these barrels or something, and on the second round it's the same way, they have no clothes, all of the um, barrels are different colored. It looks like to, to me like something to do with genealogy. Here's another woman. She's up to her waist. Almost. And she's holding on to something. Here we have the same thing. All these women are only up to their waist. They're not lower than their waist. For some reason. There's more signs. And this is the only one with, the, with them that have any clothes on. And we have more roots. And we here we here we have this weird looking thing, and it's got like a little um, uh, duck on top of it. And here we have the weird looking thing again, and we have what looks to be like a woman right there. Oh, come on. My theory is that this guy was a plant expert, but he wasn't human. And he's got women that are the forebears of the human race. It's almost like he's trying to grow them or plant them. I, saw, I know that sounds crazy, but it's the patterns that are strange. We can see one woman lying in this. It almost looks like a cocoon. Here is the same kind of other thing. It's almost like their their legs are 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 planted in this thing but not completely same with all the rest of this it's almost like they were experimenting to see if they could um, reproduce people like plants I know that's an, a very odd that's a very odd uh, uh, theory but in one of the pictures, what we have here is, we actually do have what looks like a fetus in an in a egg or something. And it kind of looks human, but it's not. Now that, that goes into my premise of maybe whatever had this thing was trying to grow humans. Same thing here. The woman is is in a almost like a, a flower pot, taking nutrients, but she's not. She's only up to her
legs. Same with up here. Here they're laying down and coming down here. And this is that pool again. So I can get one, uh, one better picture. And we have the women doing the same thing here. It, it is almost like a, a growing... They're, they're either trying to reproduce the women or humans, like plants, Uh, it's just something very strange. I will continue to investigate.